as Mr. Las Vegas, comforting many with the sounds of his voice. But tonight, he's duking it out in court. The legal battle continues over property inside what was formerly known as Casa de Shenandoah. The 13 investigative reporter Joe Bartels right now is live at the Regional Justice Center in downtown Las Vegas. And Joe, both Wayne Newton and his wife taking the stand today. Todd, they both did. They want to get back what they consider to be priceless pieces of memorabilia and their belongings from their former home. Now, as we mentioned, uh, Mr. Las Vegas himself, Wayne Newton, took the stand within the past 90 minutes. He took the stand telling the court how him. His wife, Kathleen Newton, also taking the stand, getting grilled over lease agreements and text messages as well as emails when the property was sold just as recently as July last year. The Newtons agreed to turn their 36 acre property at Pecos and Sunset into a Wayne Newton attraction filled with his most prized belongings, entertainment treasures, including stage costumes and portraits, antique cars, and even a plane. But the museum closed in 2018, and now there's a dispute over the items and who owns the legal rights to them. We were still there all the time. We still had all of our um, clothes, memorabilia, cars, all of that. Animals still all there. For me, this was really based on is our guarantee was gone. And that was Kathleen right there and Wayne Newton also taking the stand just before five o'clock telling the court how much those items again mean to him. They were passed down to him or given to him by some of the greatest stars of all time. Now this court hearing will pick up a week from today. Reporting live, Joe Bartels, 13 Action News.